I'm doing You think I can tell you that shit? Tell you that shit Why my cash at 6 in the AM? Why you still rich? Wake up I can tell me you looking at the money from a different perspective Woo! Why you blowing it up? I'm flipping them stacks Pancake breaks Taking it, flipping it, flipping it, flipping it I'm a little rich. I'm out of Columbia, Missouri, and I recently moved down here to Atlanta, Georgia. You all in my face in the like, My ambition or my goals, you know what I mean? It's like I want to go big, you know what I mean? I want to go worldwide instead of just knowing in my city or running the city. I'm trying to run the world. I had a lot of thoughts, you know. I had a lot of feelings, and I didn't know how to express it. Legally, until you know, I like started writing it down and getting in the booth and really, you know, figuring out what I'm gonna do. With it. She said her head is on fleek. I'll write a couple bars down and it'll be like I'll rap that, rehearse that, and I'll freestyle whatever I don't have after what I wrote. I'll freestyle and whatever I like in the freestyle, you know, I'll take that, add it to it, and like mix it all into one. And it'll be be a song over. I don't believe you. Well, the first song I ever wrote was Rest in Paradise, which is about my brother, Fat Man, who passed away. It's like, in the song, it tells what we did, you know, how I felt about him, you know, how I love him, miss him, and stuff like that. And like, it's really like a tribute song, you know? I don't know why they be lying to you. Really, I come from a musical background, you know, like, my father, he sings, plays the drums. My Aunt Sheila sings. My grandma sings. Like, my grandma, she used to sing at nightclubs and stuff like that all around, you know, the town. My dad, like, he been on tour. He been all around the world. That's where I'm trying to go, you know. He been on Soul Train, uh, what's it called, American Bandstand, TV and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? He done signed the contracts. He done did all that. So it's like he's teaching me now so I can be prepared for what that music industry is gonna bring me. Yeah, it did. Cause like, I take from what I see or even from what he tells me, cause like, if he mess up or if he's nervous before he go on, you, you can't tell at all. Like, like but backstage, he be like, dang, you know, I wonder if he's gonna sound good, woo woo. And he'll go out there and just, you know, destroy it, you feel me? Or if he mess up, even if he drop a stick, he got a whole other bag of him right there, boom, he prepared for what's gonna happen next. So he tells me to do the same. Minneapolis, Minnesota. That's where I grew up, you know, playing street hockey or going up the street to the corner store with my friends or even just walking two blocks. Big rich, little rich, so clean. Track back from my pocket, no I linked up with Mason J Records from my dad having old friends down here who, who brought us to uh, Mason J Records' attention. You know, he was like, I got this cat, you know, he, he do music too. He separates himself from that crowd that just wants to be cool. He has a message, he has a story, he has a backstory too. Cause that's what people want also. They want to know where is he from, what does he do? He's gonna say all that in the music. As soon as you get the EPK, you'll hear, you'll see the visuals, you know. If you don't know you, he got a song saying it. I swear I don't know you, you know what I'm saying? Like at the end of it, so everything goes down when you hear his music. So working with Bishop, you know, he brings the best out of me. He brings out things I didn't even know I had. People, they have gold chains, they have cars and a video and all that. But, you know, as soon as the camera cut off, they gotta take the gold chain off and they gotta take the keys back, you know, it's not there. So, you know, I don't believe you. And, and, and that goes not just for the guys, it goes for the girls too, you know, cause their eyelashes be all good, they edges be all, you know, on fleek, but as soon as you get in personal, you see them at school or at the store, they edges be all sweated out, head be nappy, kitchen be untamed in the bag, all that. Like. Looking for your girl, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know you, know you. Hype, you know, very crowd participation. I'm gonna be all over the stage. It's real loud and it's real live, you know, it's like, bam, right in your face. I know you. Don't know you, I don't know you. I when I go buy things or when I go out in public or they people see me driving, they're like, oh my goodness, like what what is he doing? You know, in this in this big Cadillac or what he how he being able to buy that? Like, he got all these tattoos and all that. He looks like he about 13, but nah, I'm I'm actually a grown man, I'm 18, you know, so that's funny. And like I'm I'm real goofy and I'm sarcastic, you know, real real smart at it. And I yeah. Like, my dad, he, he frustrated 24-7.
he's in my hair a lot, but uh, uh, you know, I'm having a few heart attacks behind him, but we're gonna make it work. <laughs> Other man on top. Other man on top with a polo horse. Well, the way I connect with my fans is through the social media, or hell, even in person, because like I message them back, write them back, you know, they'll support me and I'll support them or give them thanks by like, you know, showing them love like they show me love. What you gonna do with the day? With your wife, I got net in her hot spots. Me and my brother, we clown all day. And we damn made up our own language, lingo and all that. And we'll do like impersonations of other people, like famous people. Or make up our own impersonation. Everybody be dying and everybody they'll, they'll do the same thing as us. Or like one day we'll drive to the uh, Burger King backwards in the drive through And I'll order the food because I'm on the passenger side. We'll order 20 water. I ain't gonna tell you what we did with the waters, but we, you know, 20 waters, who gonna come through the job through backwards and order 20, 20 ice cream? Ridiculous. And she gonna bring us ah, Hopefully, well, I can't really say improvement or anything like that because Obama, he, I've seen the statistics of what he's doing, and he's doing it. It's just some of the ways that he got it going on, I don't really agree with. In my chain, in my pants. Hey.